Hello and welcome to my channel. Today's DIY is inspired by the bubble vase that I saw at Z Gallery. So here is an example of the inspiration. For this project, I'm using a clear glass vase that I got from the Dollar Tree, as well as glass beads that I got in the garden section of the Dollar Tree, um, an acrylic letter O that I got from jo Joanne's Fabrics, and I'm using alcohol inks for this um, project to stain the glass. And in most alcohol inks, you'll notice that it comes like in a set of three, usually in a related color palette. And so the one I got had yellow, orange, and brown. And I thought that was really uh, great since I wanted to have more amber color, like the inspiration. So now that I have the glass stain the color that I'm satisfied with, I'm going to take some of the uh, glass gems that I um, also stained off camera and just using my hot glue gun to glue them to the vase.
So here I'm taking the acrylic letter O and I'm going to glue it to the top of the base. So that way I can take the shower rings that I showed you earlier that I spray painted gold to set it on top of the O. So that way it looks like the golden top of the inspiration. And if you didn't want to follow this step, a Z Gallery also had bubble candle holders um, that look very similar to this. Of course, it was shorter. So you can always find shorter glass vases at the Dollar Tree if you don't want to use anything to cover the top and just have the bubble look for a candle holder. So after painting the uh, gold shower rings, I really didn't care too much how it turned out. It wasn't bad. But I think I probably would have tried to find like um, either a gold bangle or bracelet or something thicker, a solid piece. Um, so later on in my comparison picture, you notice I use like gold gems to kind of cover up the um, gold shower rings. Um, but I think it still came out pretty well. I'd like to thank you all for taking the time to watch my video. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And I'll see you all next week.